hello, hello, guys. Big man here, back with the island of Casamel, which I have chosen to call it. It's the island you saw in not my previous episode, but the episode or the video before that, where I had a time lapse in World Painter, where we built this amazing island right here, looking really, really nice. Um, I wanted it to be like uh, looking like a Mediterranean island. With a landscape, you know, we have lots of sand and grass and cool tropical trees and stuff. Looks pretty cool, I think. So, in today's episode, we will be building a house here. Uh, just to start off, let's build. We will build a small house right here. So, I'm recording with the new software today. I'm recording with Shadowplay. Uh, so, I hope it works out good. I hope. I Yeah, I hope it works. If not, uh, we will have a problem. I'm just going to remove some of the palms here and some of the trees. Um, yeah, I really do hope it works, because if not, this is totally a waste of time of mine. Will they despawn? I'm pretty sure they won't, because it's world painted in here. We just have to wait and see. Um, today's house, we'll build a small kind of fisherman house, I think. Um, oh, it's such a shame to just delete it, these trees here, because it looks so amazing. Um, I will put a link to the pack where I got all these trees from. In the description, if you want, would like to check them out or use it in your own world or something. Uh, there's a schematic load with lots and lots of trees from uh, Europe, from America, North and South America, from Africa, and all that stuff. So I think I just have to fly around here and break the leaves because they won't despawn by themselves here. Damn it! So yeah, I've been I'm using the context texture pack. Uh, I've done some changes to it and stuff because. You know I can, but it will be basically just um, using the normal conquest texture pack. I don't think you will even notice the changes I've done. I just made some small changes to the oak leaves and stuff. Is this an oak leaf? Yeah, it is. Um, just some small changes to it. So I don't think you will even recognize the changes. But I'm also using Optifine, which means that I have connected textures and have some new textures you probably don't have if you don't use Optifine. Whoa, sun in my face. Um, okay, getting there, and slowly, but getting there. So, I will show you some of the new blocks and stuff we have, and I will just start off with the last build here, I think. Okay, I think we got it now. Yeah, okay, so, the blocks we got, which is pretty cool, we have this one, I think. Yeah, look at that. That's the most beautiful block in the world. Um, what else? I think that's the only connected texture thing. We also have, if you push use this coarse dirt next to grass it will have like a small nice path here and yeah some stuff like that which is pretty cool so let's just start off the house here I wanted to build like in the middle here so the main materials I will use is it's a red sandstone and maybe sort them out we'll use a uh, normal stone um, yeah, granite this polished granite, we'll use cobblestone, stone bricks, and sandstone. I think that's basically for the structure of it. So, keep in mind guys, this is a let's build. I don't really know um, what I'm doing now. I have some knowledge, but I have not planned any of this um, beforehand. So, I'm just going to make some kind of layout here. Like this, it's getting night time, I think. So let's just turn it back to day. Look at that beautiful sunset here. Uh, time set day, yeah, day. Like that, like so. Pretty nice. I hope it's okay for you guys that I'm using shaders. Uh, th I just think it really gives this house a small, nice uh, feel to it. So I want the bottom of the houses to have like this. Uh, red sandstone material um, block theme thing. I don't know. Uh, so it just build some random stuff. There will be lots of random blocks in this uh, build here because that's kind of the way I want it to look. Kind of randomish. So I'm just gonna make some of this. This will be some kind of tower, I think, in just in a small tower in the front of the build, just like this. Um, and okay, so. What I will do in just almost every part of the build is change out a lot of the blocks here with other stuff. 
like this. Uh, put in some sandstone. Put in some cobblestone. Everywhere like this, and it will look pretty cool in the end. Uh, I've tested it out, so just you have to trust me on this one, guys. You definitely have to trust me. Uh, so just lots of random blocks everywhere. But it will give like a nice Mediterranean feel to it, I think, because many of the Mediterranean pools in real life are kind of worn down because they're so old, many of them. I'm sorry, guys, I kind of got a cold here. Um, and so I'm a little bit uh, runny nose and stuff, and my, my voice is a little bit raspy, but I think you can survive that. Um, yeah. I, I, thought, I just think it will be for this episode of the build here that my voice will be raspy because. I only have time to record one episode today. Just making sure on time. Okay, so we have. Okay, I'm just don't want to make this video too long. It might be very long though. I don't know. Um, so I'm just rising up this wall here. Slowly but surely. Uh, I don't know how tall it will be though. I don't. I think it. Okay, so I'm just gonna bring out some. Where are you? There you are. Uh, and some I will use these for frames as on the windows here, like that. Uh, make them too tall, like that. Okay, so that's one window, and we'll have another story above this, I think. So like this. Just continuing this up here. I will do the random session of camera, I think, because that takes a lot of time, actually. Uh, so you don't have to watch me do all that over and over and over again. Because that's quite boring. I've seen people do that on camera myself, and I just... I don't seem to enjoy it. Uh, I really enjoy doing it myself, because it really makes you... You have to think a lot. Uh, because it doesn't... It, it doesn't have to look like a uh, chest pattern, uh, if you know what I mean. You really have to make it look natural, or make it look random. Okay, so now we have two floors like that. Okay, rise it up one more, and we'll put a roof on this bad boy here. Uh, like this. So guys, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Um, the spring is finally coming to Norway. Uh, I've been out jumping on a trampoline earlier today, because I, that's one thing I really like about summer, just jumping on a trampoline. Uh, I use a skateboard while uh, jump on skateboard trampoline skateboarding. I don't know if that's a thing in all the world, but I just really like to do it. Um, doing lots of tricks that I would not uh, dare to do uh, on flat ground. So that's pretty cool. So that's what I've been up to. I've been up. I've been skating a lot on my trampoline and yeah, just working out because yeah, summer is here. I need to get in shape. And it also, it's a very nice weather for me to go out biking and stuff. So something like that, I think. It looks very cool already. I'm really satisfied with this. Um, let's fill in the roof here. We'll use lots of different blocks on the roof as well, because I also want that to look worn out. So just first off, I'm just gonna fill it all in like this. Make it look like a roof so we don't get water in here. And then um, there we are, jungle wood. and. Also want to use a nether bricks thing, nether brick slab, yeah. So if we do like this, just push, put this in nether somewhere, not as uh, frequently as you would do with the other, okay, other blocks types here. Like this I think. Then put in some jungle wood. Jungle wood you can use that very, very much because it really blends nice in with the. Um, with um, the bricks here, so I can use that a lot, I think, um, like that. So this nether brick kind of looks like it's some kind of rusty, um, which I kind of like. Maybe make it seems like they have tried to enforce the roof with some uh, steel plates or uh, metal, you know. Oh crap, that's the wrong block. Uh, metal stuff to make it last a little bit longer, which they probably would have done. Oh, that's the wrong block. Uh, because some of these builds are really old, as I told you, in real life though. <laughs> this one isn't done yet. So, I'm trying to keep it as realistic as possible. That roof looks pretty cool. Maybe add some more stuff here, like that. And it looks pretty neat. What we also can do is take some 
and just stairs like that. If we place that like there, for example, um, and here like that, you know, we have some kind of an uneven shapes here, which I think will look good like that. So what I will do now, guys, is go ahead and do some randomization on the walls and the side of the bull here, and be right back in just a second. It's already looking a lot better than before I started doing the random session. Turn it back to daytime here. So I just realized that the shadow play from Nvidia really makes my voice seem raspy. It's not that raspy in real life. I think I might have to do some configurations and stuff for the next episode. But for now I just have to live with it, I think. Um, but my voice sounds really, really bad. I'm just going to put in some random blocks like that, I think. Uh, might look it look a little bit better. So yeah, you see what I, what I did with the random session here. It looks pretty neat, I think. Um, and some of that here. So what else we gotta do is, I want to extend this out here. I will use the red sandstone like this, where we'll have a door here, window here. Uh, okay, so here's the middle, like that, and then make it go back over here and even further back than this one like this something like this is the main structure of the house you also will have to do some small roofs and stuff make it look pretty also it's a fisherman's house we'll have to do some stuff to make it look realistic i think i'm just rising up this this here making it look nice and sweet uh, like that maybe bring that up so in this area here, yeah, we'll always, always oh, I can't speak today. It's kind of early in the morning. Uh, I'm sorry for that, guys. Uh, give me some oak thing here. Um, only have one story tall, like this. Yeah, I will go for one, only one story and then like this. Then just rise it all up around here. <laughs> Using just stone as usual, and I will do the random stuff in between the two cuts here later in just a second. So, like, no, these are too tall. Um, like that, I think. Yeah, perfect. Um, might tune down the red sandstone here a little because it looks kind of overwhelming here. Something like that. Yeah, that's better. Uh, also, just continue the wall back here, like that. So guys, do you have any suggestions for bulls I should add to this island here, to the Castle Mill Island? Because um, I, I know I will do a castle, I will do a tower, a watchtower of some sort. Um, and yeah, so I don't, I don't know what all the different kind of builds that I could add in this build because there's so many possibilities. So if you have any suggestions of the builds you would like to see, maybe you're wondering of some builds and stuff, uh, I'm not promise you that I will be able to do them myself because I'm not a god in Minecraft, uh, even though I wish I were. But um, I could probably help you out if if it's possible for me to do it. So if you have any builds that you all wanted to build maybe, but you don't know how to, or you just want me to build a house because you think they look good or, you know, anything at all. Just let me know, guys, if there's anything you want me to build and put on this island here. Of course, in the Mediterranean style. Uh, I don't want to build, like, a modern house here or, yeah, you know. So, if you have any suggestions for builds, let me know. Also, if you have any builds you would like me to see in another let's build, possibly, or just a showcase or something. Tutorial, maybe. Uh like a modern house or something let me know as well because i'm not doing youtube videos so that i can watch them because i can play minecraft you know so if i want to make sure that all of my viewers get what they want when they watch my channel so if you have anything you would like me to do any games any buildings i don't know you name it you just let me know guys and i will be on the case oh fell down here uh, i'll be on the case hopefully being able to bring up a video as soon as possible after you ask for it and yeah we can all be happy I guess I also want to thank all the new subscribers I've gotten lately and it really cheers me up to see that new people are subscribing to my channel uh, it really makes me feel good and makes me want to make even more videos 
which some of you guys really seem to enjoy. Uh, so that's really cool. Thank you so much, guys. As well, I want to thank you for the support on Revenge of the Sea Team videos because I, I just really, really enjoy those videos. These are those are my favorite video to do at the moment because I can just really dwell into the world of Revenge of the Sea Team. Uh, it's the biggest mod pack I've ever played. I don't have I haven't played many mod packs though, so um, that's not the big thing. But yeah, I just really, really like the way it's all so perfectly matched together and you can just dwell and dwell into it for days at a time. Uh, which might be a bad thing, but yeah, I really, really, really like it. So, thank you so much guys for support and stuff and hope to see you guys around supporting me even more in the future. Okay, so is the roof looking good? Yeah, let's add some, some stairs and stuff. Also want to add uh, jungle stairs. So like here, for example, if we do like that, uh, we can add... No, not like that. Uh, we can make it like this, so it looks kind of inwards like that. Um, put some there, I guess. There's lots of possibilities for where you can place them. Like that. Looks pretty neat. Yeah, I like that. So I think the roof is done now. Well, remaining now is for me to do some randomization on these walls and stuff. And yeah, I'll see you after a small break. Okay guys, I'm back. So let's just continue this bad boy here. Uh, what I want to do is add a balcony up here. Because it looks pretty, pretty neat, I think. Just adding some balconies and stuff. So let's see. Oh, what? There you are. Um, and what else can we use? Let's use trapdoor, I think, for fencing. Uh, turn it back to daytime. Oh like that so how will we do this um, I kind of want to use the fence doors but I don't think that will actually work let's just use normal fences we can use the spruce fences to make some contrast here um, so like that put in uh, put in a stone brick there and something like this I think look good. Yeah, just like a small balcony up there. It's not functional though, but it, I think it look pretty neat just adding a small balcony up there. Uh, also add some windows here to this side. Where is you? There you are. Um, so what I want to do is to make like the stair going up here. So if I add a window like uh, elevated up and then another one like that I think would look pretty cool. Yeah, just like that. And on the back here um, this is the right level. Oh, whoa, leg spike. Um, this is the right level. So, like that, and then another one back here. I don't want to put a window overlooking the small lower part here. But, guys, this looks pretty nice. I'm really satisfied. Also, really like the random session of blocks on the walls here and stuff. Uh, what I want to do is to just add some detailing trims and stuff, I think. Uh, oh. I want to use this, guys. This is also one of the blocks that I have. Crap! It's not. It's not working with. Um, with the Optifine. So I I uh, retextured the uh, mossy cobblestone to be a wooden block, so I can use like some kind of smaller wooden beams. But yeah, it doesn't work. Unfortunately. Um, what you also can do is do like this. And it looks, yeah, that looks way better. So let's find some cool items. Think we can, we can do as windows. I want to use the spruce as uh, window, but I also want to use stained clay. So I want to do a mixture like that. We have glass in bottom and then a wood part on top. And kind of makes sense that you can like. Uh, open up the upper part to get some air in and stuff because it might get really hot on these tropical islands here um, Let's just put it here and there like that no windows on the back yet. I might have to do that later um, Yeah, so this is looking pretty pretty neat um, So what we want to do now is to make some kind of overhang <laughs> Over where the entrance will be uh, the entrance will be Elevate it up from the ground a little, just like this. Put a door in. 
Uh, how's this boot store looking? Yeah, that look good. Um, put you in there, like that, like so. Put one on top like that. Oh, it looks so amazing. I really like this, guys. Let's take a look from far. Yeah, that looks pretty neat. So what we want to do as well is um, add some kind of like front yard, I think, using gravel, cobblestone, and uh, stone slabs. We might possibly use polished andesite. How are you looking? Yeah, that looks better, I think. Um, so just make some kind of pattern here with using these blocks. I uh, could also just like something like this, put in all the different blocks, looking pretty sweet like that, and putting the fences in, and it can be like a small way down here to the ground like that, yeah, that looks better. Also I want to add some kind of overhanging bit here with using this. Um, like that. This will interact with this window also. Just let's remove that. Uh, add some random blocks into it, like that. And then just like it is, like so. Yeah, I like that. I really like that. Um, so it's looking pretty neat at the moment. Yeah, also, yeah, the detail trims. I totally forgot about those. Uh, I think we can use red sandstone. There's a detailed frame on top here. Might even move it one more in. Like that. I'm not sure if I like that or not. I don't think I do. Um, fate fate gants, uh, gate fence. That's better. Let's use those. Place those here. Also, guys, give me fe some feedback if you like me recording with um, shaders or not. I know it might be a little bit bright for some of you guys, so uh, I want to try one episode. Uh, if you guys like it, feel free to let me know. If you don't like it, also feel free to let me know. Because, yeah, no point for me making videos if you guys can watch it. So, put some fence doors on these, I think. Some kind of cover up for the windows. I think that will look good. Cool. Oh, forgot a window. Ah, the new and new. That was spruce, yeah, yeah, it was spruce. Use and then put some of this cover up, window cover ups on the side. Yeah, looking pretty, pretty sweet here. Uh, and on the top as well. Like that. I was wondering if there might be some blocks with some cool detailing. We could use to put on maybe. Just maybe this will look good. Oh yeah, I like that one. That I like. Uh put that up here like that. Yeah, let's go for that. So it's really hard for me to tell what kind of blocks I'm using because uh, this is chisel sand and stone bricks, I mean. But it really looks different on the texture while uh, after you place it, you do, uh, because of the Optifine things, connected textures. Let's also just put it here. Um, and like here. Yeah, that looks awesome. So it's time for some landscaping, I think. Uh, you can use some spruce woods, I think. Just make this crawl up the bull like this. Because it's tropical and some kind, of, looking kind of like vines, I think. Uh, going up like this, crawling on top of the roof here, on the top of the side, looking, yeah, just spamming the leaves all over here. Yeah, looking pretty sweet. The inside um, will be kind of simple, I think, because this is not the richest house of all mankind. Maybe use a different block. No, use. let's use oak. I really like the texture of oak. Um, putting it in here like this. Uh, all around the place here. Oh, it's getting really dark in here. I don't hope this video is too long. Um, we might have to see. I have totally forgot about time. 
So, might be a little long, but I hope you guys will survive. I really, I really hope you survive because if all my subscribers died, I will be kind of sad for me. And even more sad for the families for the guys who died. Uh, and sad for me to be the reason why. So, yeah. Awkward moment right there. Just filling in the walls here. Like this. Yeah, it looks pretty sweet. And uh, also here's the tower, or bigger part of the build. Move this up. So, we'll have to make some kind of stair going up to this level here. Like this. Uh, and what we can do up here, which looks pretty cool, is take some of this. Um, oh, okay. Well, well, let's just make the stair first, then do the rest here. Oh wow! Oh, I didn't I think about this. And let's do it like that, and then... Yeah, like this. Okay! Okay, okay. Pretty cool. Uh, yeah, loose spr spruce wood, like this. Very small up here, but I like it. Up top on the roof here we can do something, which I actually wanted to do down here, but because of the stair and stuff, I couldn't do it. Uh, play some logs and then slabs in. I promise you it will look good. It will look good. Like this. Very nice. I really like the cozy feel. Let's also add a stair up here. Um, yeah, let's just do it like that. And where are you? Spruce wood door. Oh, turn back to day. I can't get out of here though, so crap. So I uh, guys, um, I realize this video is getting really long. Uh, so what I will do is I will cut this episode here. I do a lot of work, or well, not a lot of work, just doing some interior stuff on this build. Uh, just adding some chairs and stuff. Uh, and I will show you uh, in the beginning of next episode or next video of this let's build here. Uh, yeah, because it's just taking too long. Let's just fix this off and I think we're done guys. So thank you so much for watching guys. I really do hope you enjoy. If so, make sure to smack that subscribe button really really hard and tell all of your friends. Yes, thanks so much for watching guys. See y'all later.